Hi, thanks for checking out this lesson. We are going to learn Piano Man by Billy Joel on the smallest piano you've ever seen. We're going to start with a C. I'll play it first and then we'll learn the chords. The trick here is that we're gonna make the bass descend as we go. Now, unfortunately, because it's written in C, we do run out of room a little bit towards the bottom of the scale, but I'll show you how you get around that. So we've got a C major. Right, so you basically hit the bass, strum twice. Bass, strum, strum. Then we can play G with a B bass. Just one finger. And then we're gonna play F with an A bass and then C with a G bass. Whoops. <laughs> okay, so those first two bars you get C, G, A, F. Right. Then we're gonna hit an F major seven. Now I've just grabbed my thumb over the top, there's an F, and this top string is an open E, hence F major seven. Then change to a C, but hit the E. This is where we have to kind of come around. It'd be great if we just continued on. It just doesn't work like that with the guitar. So, D minor, G7. Okay, so those first four bars are C. G over B, F over A, G over C over G, F major seven, C over E, D minor, G7. Right, second line. We've got a lot of the same sort of stuff. C over B, over A, C over G. Now, F. Then we've got F over G. Either do, which but that might be a bit hard, but with your thumb there, the G with your thumb. Or you could just move this one over and just kind of sit on the A, right? There you go, you've got G, and then C. Right? And then C to F with the C bass, right? So that whole line is C, B, F over A, C over G, F, G in the bass, C, Then the final bit, the down, 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 down. Now we've got. You could do that, or you could make it a bit busier. So you get one, two, and three, and, and then F, C with an E bass. Just lift those guys up. On my chart, I've got D minor seven written. You know. Do that, or you could just go because you're so quickly through that, it doesn't really matter. See, see what I mean? Up to you. This is an arrangement, after all. Okay, and then the song starts now. In the first verse, we've got a lot of the same chords. They just resolve differently at the end. So that first verse is. Okay, and then the harmonica comes in. So what we played there was C over B over A over G, same as we had before, then F major, C over E, D major, G, then C over B, F over A, whoops, F over A I mean, C over G, F major over G, and then a full bar of C, so one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. 
Then the harmonica comes in and it plays. And the melody goes up and he basically plays what we've already had. C over B over A, C over G, F, E, D major, G, C over B, A over G, F, and then, right? Now, and then we're going to go into a new section, an A minor section, So, but we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and then just hit a B in the bass, and then you're going to play A minor, and this is the la, 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 la section. Okay, so that goes A minor. Now, you can play a G with your pinky, or just pull it out. I know you've got slightly different chord here. It's A minor 7 over G instead of A minor over G, but it's all good. And then we're going to play uh, F sharp with your thumb and a D7. And then an F major. And then A minor. G in the bass again. And then D7 with the F sharp bass. Now, then we've got a descending line over a G. So we play G. Then you've got that F in there, so it's basically a G with an F in the bass. Then you're going to swap around, play a C with an E in the bass. And then you're going to play G7 with a D in the bass. Okay, so that section is G, F in the bass, C over E, D. So at the end of the bridge, it plays the chorus, which is the same sort of chords we had, C, G over B, F over A, C over G, etc, etc. And then it loops around and plays all the other sections in order. And that's the end of the song. If you're interested in a guitar approach to another piano song, check out this one. See you next time. Bye for now.